get that grub on. You know what I am. It's your boy, Mr. Grub, back again with another video for you guys. And today, I went ahead and uh, decided to give you some chicken wings and fries. Went to a place called Shammy's Rib and Chicken Shack in Fort Pierce. Um, I'll drop that address down below for you guys. I went there to give me some chicken and fries, man. And I mean, they have some of the best deals like you can think of. So. Uh, I got the 20 piece mild chicken uh, with the large fry uh, for 11 bucks. Damn! Damn! So you can't beat that, man. So I went ahead and got that. I want to try that out. Got me a little barbecue sauce on the side. Um, I like the flavor, you know, to add the barbecue sauce. But uh, I'm going to let you guys go ahead and see this. And uh, we're going to jump right into it, man. Check it out. So we're gonna go ahead and test this out. I'll let you guys know how it is, how's everything tasting, uh, and then we'll go from there, man. So we're gonna get first bite for this chicken. taste the, the mild sauce on the initial bite, man. I like the fact that uh, they made it extra wet. So it's not like you your chicken's dry. It's very moist. It's very well cooked through. It's hot. I love it, man. I'm not just saying that because I like chicken. They did a great job. So you always get skeptical when you, uh, you go to a place and it's less expensive. You know, I think our minds have been triggered so much lately that if something costs less, it's probably going to have a lesser value. Um, it's probably going to have lesser quality. Um, but that's, that's the whole point of, you know, what I always try to say is you can't judge the book by its cover. You know, uh, more doesn't always mean better. You know, things like that because this is really good chicken, especially for the price. I'm completely surprised, but I'm also impressed, you know, because even though it's less expensive, they didn't uh, try to go light on it or not care as much about it. Uh, you know, very customer friendly. Definitely wanted you to have the best experience when you're there. So, you know, uh, shout out to them for that. Uh, if you guys are ever in the Fort Pierce area, man, definitely check them out. Uh, you know, it's very good at a very reasonable price. You know, the wait time isn't long or anything like that. So, uh, it's actually beneficial to people who are on lunch break and things like that who, you know, just want to have some chicken wings and fries, man, you know, at a, at a reasonable price. You know, I ate a lot of food yesterday, uh, as most of you may or may not have seen. So, I always told you Sundays I try not to go too crazy. That's why I decided to eat a little earlier, uh, have like a nice, you know, simple type of lunch. So that way you can kind of carry me over. Um, you know, Christmas in two days, man, so I got to get ready for that, that good Christmas meal, man. I'm definitely going to show you guys that when it comes up. So don't worry. You definitely be a part of my Christmas too. <laughs> Good fries too. Now, you know, I like having ketchup on my fries, things like that. But if I can enjoy your fries without ketchup, you have good fries. A lot of people use ketchup to mask the taste. I don't need it. So shout out to Chamis for that. Guys, definitely check them out if you're in the Fort Pierce area, man. You will not regret it. You know, they took care of me today. So I know they'll take care of you guys, too. Well, Shabby's, you get a 10 from Mr. Grubb. Y'all heard it first here. 
So if you're ever in the area, man, don't forget to check them out. You know, they'll take care of you right here in Fort Pierce. So I'm going to go ahead and finish my food up. I'll get back to you guys next time, man. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment below if you know any places that you think I might enjoy or might not, man. You know, I'm there to put them to the test. So until next time, you guys, it's your boy, Mr. Grub. I'm out.